Let's go, it's the Whitey Show. The series has all boiled down to this. You knew from the get-go that we'd lose a lot of faces because, well, this is based off the Walking Dead comic and a lot of people die. The bond between Clem and Lee has been extremely strong, always feeling like a father and daughter relationship. Then in the fourth episode, spoilers ahead, Clem is taken and poor Lee is bit by a fucking zombie. We have very little time and we have to get Clem back as quick as possible. Just hold on, Clementine. Coming for you. This episode's pacing is extremely fast. No time left and we must get to Clem before Lee turns into a zombie. He's slowly becoming one and begins to go through blackouts and such and just you want to get there really fast. So it feels like it's getting closer to him becoming a zombie and you losing time to get to Clem. This brings us back to the main objective, just getting to Clem before he becomes a zombie. It makes the episode very nail biting. I love so many different characters in the series, so when it comes to an end, I almost cried. The ending was great, the middle was a basically an adrenaline rush, and the beginning gave you a slight hope, all leading the series up to this, and a perfect way to go out. Besides the final confrontation with a certain someone, I loved every second of this episode. Said all that shit, and not do something now. Come on, reach! I got you, hun! Save her! Go, go, go! Do you fucking hear me? Get Kenny! The game stays strong in the graphics department. A few hiccups and lag don't hold hurt the overall art design. As strong as before, with some wonderful character designs, this little arcade title looks pretty much beautiful. The gameplay stays largely the same. You go into some badass situations in this title and just fucking up zombies. I mean like chopping heads off, stabbing them in the eye, slicing their stomach open. Some really gritty ass awesome gameplay that you didn't see in the previous titles. <laughs> The puzzles are almost gone completely, however there's plenty of meaty dialogue and a lot of fun gameplay sections that will keep you on the edge of your seat. You'll get into bloody fights and you'll get into some verbal fights. Either way, both fights are pretty much some of the most intense moments in gaming right now. Just... fucking hell. At least he told us. Took some brass. I don't think I would. Overall, I love this episode. It's, you know, really quick and over before you know it, which is a bit sad. Um, however, if you enjoyed all the episodes up until now, you'll love the shit out of this title. There's lots of nail-biting scenes that make it an enjoyable little title package that's so cheap. I can't recommend the entire series enough. So again, buy the whole damn series. It's fucking excellent top title in one of the best series this year. I scored this episode a 9 out of 10 and loved almost every moment of it, even if it was a little bit shorter than the others, clocking in about an hour and a half. Just buy this game. That's all I gotta say. Just buy it. It's an awesome game. Buy all of them. They're all fucking great. Great, great series. One of the best. Take their goddamn arms off! <laughs> Now what? Now just remember to take a moment to like, subscribe, and comment. Thank you guys.